Are we inside of a black hole? As mysterious as our universe is, this theory gives a new perspective towards the universe and the reality itself. Let's break it down. A black hole forms when a massive star reaches the end of its life. Its core collapses under the force of its own gravity so powerfully that it creates a region where the laws of physics begin to break down. The edge of this region is called the event horizon, a boundary beyond which nothing can escape, not even light. Once you cross it, you're no longer part of the universe outside. You're falling inward forever. Our universe, the one we live in, also seems to have its own cosmic horizon, a boundary beyond which light can't reach us. Not because of gravity, but because of how fast space itself is expanding. Just like a black hole's event horizon, once something crosses that boundary, it's gone, forever cut off from view. If you calculate the total mass of our universe and compare it to the mass of black hole, which would need to match its size, you get something shocking. They're almost the same. A universe the size of ours, with the mass we observe, would fit the characteristics of a black hole if seen from the outside. This isn't just poetic coincidence, it's mathematical alignment. Let's make it simpler for you. Our universe is about 93 billion light years wide and contains an estimated mass of roughly 10 to the power of 53 kilograms. That's a one followed by 53 zeros. If you were to create a black hole as large as the observable universe, it would need to have almost exactly that much mass. In other words, if the universe were a black hole, it would look just like this from the outside. Same size, same mass, same horizon. So what if it's not a coincidence? What if we're not just looking at the universe from within, but looking outward from deep inside a black hole. According to Einstein, a black hole isn't just a collapsed star. It's a distortion in space and time itself. So extreme that it bends reality into something new. And the equations of general relativity don't stop at the singularity. In fact, they suggest that beyond that singularity, there could be something else. A bridge, a tunnel, a doorway to another region of space-time. The theory suggests that our universe could be the inside of a black hole formed in another far more massive universe. A universe we'll never see, but one that might exist on a scale beyond anything we can imagine. For them, we are microscopic, just a tiny bubble of space and time barely a flicker in their unimaginable vastness. But for us, they are unreachable, a realm beyond our dimensions, beyond our physics, beyond even our ability to imagine. Our universe might just be one drop in an infinite ocean of realities, each one isolated, each one unaware of the others, each one born inside a black hole. Every black hole in our universe could be the seed of another universe, and every one of those universes might contain its own black holes and its own realities within them. Realities stacked within realities, dimensions inside dimensions. A multiverse, not spread out like parallel lines, but nested deep inside gravitational wells. But can we ever know for sure? Right now, there's no way to look beyond our cosmic horizon. No instrument can peer outside the universe to check if we're truly inside something else. And even if we were, the laws of physics as we know them wouldn't apply beyond that boundary. It's like trying to understand the ocean while trapped inside a single drop of water. Endless creation, inside endless destruction, worlds within worlds, and we are just one of them. So next time you look up at the night sky, remember, you might not be looking out into the universe. You might be looking deeper in.
If this twisted the way you see reality, hit that subscribe button and join us for the next journey into the unknown.